Hi everyone, um, I'm here today with a few bits of news. So the first one is that I got a new tattoo and I know I mentioned in a video that I was going to get one and I did, the day I came back from Spain I went down to the tattoo parlour and got it. So um, I'll tell you about, more about that in a minute. The second bit of news is way better. You can take off these bangles, they're annoying me. The second bit of news is I got a new puppy. And this is her here. Her name is Poppy. And she's so cute. And she's really bold. Aren't she? She's really bold um, and really small. And she's really sleepy at the moment. Um, Alvin seems to really like her. He's taking care of her. We were like a little bit worried that he might be jealous and but she seems quite happy to pot her around after and make sure she's okay. But she's super cute. She like she has a real bold face like a little e walk. Um I'm going to put her down so she can go see. Good girl. Um so that was really exciting. And then um my tattoo. So my tattoo, the, the one I had in mind, um, it was going to say, just along my neck, and it was going to say, it's not on how we fall, but how we rise. And I wanted to get one on my neck for uh, quite a long time, but I didn't know what I wanted it to say. So I had to wait until I had something significant or something that meant something. So um, I, I, I came across that phrase and it just, you know, I just thought it was perfect. Um, so I had it translated um, into another language. So I'll show you a picture now. Okay, so lastly, um, I picked up a few things when I was in Boots the other day. I went in to buy a lipstick to do, um, a, just a stronger coloured lipstick to do a tutorial with. And I ended up coming out with a few things, so I'll just show you them. So the first thing I got was, uh, is not the lipstick I went in for, but it was when I bought um, the first lot of things, I got a voucher for number seven. And I usually hate number, I actually like their skincare, number seven skincare, but I hate their makeup. I, not hate, hate it is strong, okay. Um, I tend to dislike it. I find their eyeshadows very poorly pigmented. And that, again, it suits, it's, I, I put them on a par with, let's say, with Avon quads, eyeshadow quads, and some some people love those. And I did myself when I was younger when I liked a kind of a soft wash of colour, um, but not anymore. So, um, uh, but I, I, I had the voucher and I thought I'll have to buy something. So I bought this lipstick and I, I absolutely love it. I'm wearing it at the moment. I wasn't even sure when I chose it whether I'd even like it that much. I just got it because I needed to get it, get something. Um, it's in number in number twenty, and it's called Star Shell, and it's really, really pretty. It looks, it seems, to be, it's actually really like my own, my natural lip color. Another thing I got um, by number from number seven is their new mascara, and I, I, I think you know by now that I love mascaras. So this one's extravagant lashes, or extra, yeah, extravagant lashes, and um, I actually quite like the packaging on it. I've never tried a number seven um, mascara before. Ooh. So the wand is square. Uh, I haven't given it a try. I probably should have today and I didn't think of it. Um, it is quite expensive. Like it, it's more expensive than like the L'Oreal Telescopic and um, uh, Maybelline Nash Stiletto, which are my favourite mascaras. So it better be good. <laughs> um, I'm not sure. I think it was about 15 or 16 euros, so it would want to be good. But I thought I'd give it a go. Um, I decided to to, to pick, a, pick up a brighter lipstick for doing kind of certain tutorials and that because I tend to always buy nudes. So um, I chose this one and this is, I don't even know, where, who makes it? I think it's Maybelline. How bad is that on the packaging? It actually doesn't have their brand. Ma yeah, Maybelline is a tiny little thing. It should be plastered on the side. Anyway, it's in Coral Fire, which is number 440. And I like the packaging, it's really nice. And here's the colour. So it's kind of like an orange red. Um my oh, we tr my mum tried this on and it looked actually really natural on her. It almost just looked like she was wearing a nude lipstick, whereas on me it'll look really extreme. But it was the only shade that I could find that I thought might suit my skin tone. Okay, some more things I got. I got um a Barry M glossy tube. And it's one of the special edition ones. And it doesn't have a number, but it's this one here. And it's really like it's, it's really bright, but I really like it. Here's it there. It 
extremely nice. It's kind of fuchsia. Okay, and when I, my sister and I were in uh, Penny's Primark, and she was having, we were having a look at some of the, I was going back for more coconut products from their fat bath and body range, and we noticed these, and this caught my eye. And I'm not really sure why I bought this. This is just like, oh, you know when something just grabs your eye and you, 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 you buy it and you're thinking, where will I wear that? Um, but I think they're €2.50 and um, they have really cool colours. Like there was um, a really nice red orange shade that was really nice as well, but I really like this. And I tried it on it looks quite nice. And But I, I just wore it with it like I was wearing like a blue and navy check shirt with my indigo skinny jeans and it just kind of went with the outfit. I'm not sure what else I'd be able to wear it with though. And then I just just to try them, there was eye pencils, and I got these two. There's the ice cream man again. Um, but I got these two, and they they come in a pack together, and they cost one fifty, so they're really cheap. And if they're blue and pink, and I thought these will be hard and they won't be um, pigmented, I was wrong. They're very pigmented, and they're really creamy and easy to apply. And I used the blue one. Um, already look how like how bright that is. So really impressed. Um, I might go back and see if they. I think they had green and another shade as well. Uh, but well worth it. So that's it for today. And um, keep the request coming. And don't forget to subscribe and rate if you can. And uh, I'll talk to you guys soon. Have a great week. Bye.